Today's a good day to be out uh, attending the golf outing for the mayor uh, for raising funds for upcoming election and it's always a good time to be out on the golf course and uh, meeting up with uh, old friends and new friends alike. Um, we have uh, 53 foursomes, so you know about 212 golfers, so that's very exciting. Oh, I'm thinking that I'm very fortunate to have so many supporters and uh, people that are willing to uh, help me out and get things going here. And everybody is just looking forward to a great day, fellowship, fun, and golf, and lots of hole-in-one sponsors. And we've got two boats, no, one boat, two cars, a motorcycle, and a Kubota. I want to thank Mayor Ogle for inviting us out, Sender and Company, for inviting us out today. It's a great day, beautiful day. It's the end of the year golf outing. Um, so we're just happy to be out and again enjoy good friends, and meet up with a lot of people and have a lot of laughs today. So. Share, some, share some camaraderie with all the friends and support our new, we got out of work, and support our mayor. I like Portis. I lived there all my life. I think Olga's doing a great job. Olga's doing a good, good job getting the, you know, the infrastructure going and Portage is turning around. And I got my business there. I've been a lifelong resident. Well, being a uh, lifetime resident of Portage, I, I've seen the town grow over the years. I remember when Old Willow Creek Road was just a one-lane road. And uh, we used to ride our bikes over the hump on the bridge on Willow Creek. So I've seen it come a long, long way. And the progress has been phenomenal. The thing I like about Portage is the people, the bike trails, and the, and the park systems, and now the lake trail. Restaurants, the bars, the bars, the restaurants. I like the fact that it's a nice place uh, where you can take a nice leisurely walk. Yep. People are very nice. It's a good community to live in. Grew up in Portage. Best uh, best place to uh, raise a family, and uh, we're all better off for um, coming from there. Go Portage, Indian. <laughs> I love the trails, honestly. I think one of the, tra the trails is probably one of the neatest things. I think it sets us apart, plus uh, the river walk. I, I mean, I love it there. I think it's fabulous that we turned something that was so horrible into something wonderful. Well, I deal with communities all around Northwest Indiana, and I like the progressive nature of the city of Portage. Uh, their downtown redevelopment uh, efforts, uh, all of the development that they're uh, doing along Highway 6 at uh, the south end of the community. I think that makes for a vibrant town. I'm the uh, city planner. Uh, oh. Just out here to support the mayor. We do whatever, whatever we can. <laughs> so we're really busy doing a lot with the redevelopment commission. Um, getting ready to start the uh, parks plan here in the next few months. Well, the city has been very good to me. Uh, I work for a family business in town. And it's, it's nice to be involved. Uh, I like the mayor. I like the city the city's been good to me and we appreciate portage life and all they're trying to do for us it's a great city because of the people who live here i, I am uh, in business for over 10 years here in portage i am the city's medical benefits broker i'm out here to support merrill of velasquez i own boomers pub and grub catwig and sons construction i like all the youth activity here we do a lot of stuff for the kids very important every community should I love Pop Warner football. I've been coaching it for 41 years. <laughs> One of mine right by out there, Mark Miller. Really? He used to play for him when he was about nine years old. Yeah, I put about 3,000 kids through Portage High School, a football player. Yeah, about 35 years ago. How many we, we had about, about three state championships in that What's that? Yeah, run. we went to Naperville? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Illinois won that one too. This guy was fast, you couldn't even. Yeah, I don't, I don't have look three times to see. <laughs> well, we're happy to be out here. It's nice that it, uh, the weather's hold out here for the first time in a couple years, so we're happy about that. It's great to see the turnout. Uh, well, I love a lot about Portage. I love our city. I love my mayor. Uh, I've been living here for about uh, 36 years. Well, I like to see the changes that our mayor has made. Uh, she's done a, quite, quite a few good things and whatever. Uh, First of all, I'd like to thank all of you for coming. She has been the best mayor I've ever been around. And I don't just say that because she gives me a job. <laughs> Without a doubt, all you have to do when you drive home tonight is see the progress that's going on in our city. Yeah, so I'd like to introduce Mayor Olga Velasquez. The um, 
the financial picture is can be gloom and doom. But I think it's my position and my job and my responsibility to be that leader that looks at the possibilities, to be that leader to find a way to make it happen. We've been finding a way to make it happen. We've got road projects going. We've got uh, construction projects going. We've got a building project getting ready to go. We are putting people to work and continuing to do that. My mantra has been not to have to lay anybody off and to continue to find a way to move our city forward. Lots of good things happening. I really appreciate your support and together next November we'll be able to do this another four years and really make Portage on the map.